question is if a driver drives a car four laps at 10 km per hour for the first lap 20 km per hour for the second lap 30 km per hour for the third lap and 60 km per hour for the fourth lap what is his average speed what is his average speed so this is practically a speed time distance problem it is a speed time distance problem average speed some of these students agree with the answer as 10 plus 20 plus 30 plus 60 divided by 4 and they agree with the answer as 40 but let me make it very clear this 10 plus 20 plus 30 plus 60 120 divided by 4 30 is a wrong answer because it is the average of the four numbers and not the average the average of the four numbers and not the average velocity average velocity is always total distance travelled by total time taken average velocity is always total distance travelled by total time taken for example I'll give an example as from chennai to trichy is 320 kilometers from chennai to trichy is 320 kilometers if i travel in 5 hours time the average speed will be 320 divided by 5 the average speed will be 320 divided by 5 64 kilometers the average speed will be 64 kilometers supposing from chennai to trichy is 320 kilometers i take 5 hours to travel so 320 divided by 5 will be 60. I could have traveled 100 kilometers per hour. I could have traveled at 80 kilometers per hour. I could have traveled at 30 kilometers per hour. I cannot do it as 100 plus 80 plus 30 divided by 3. That is not average speed. So total distance travel by total time will be the average speed. So here the distance is not known. Here the distance is not known. So I will make the each lap distance as D. Each lap distance as D. D is the distance for each lap. D is the distance for each lap. Time taken for each lap. Time taken. So it will be D by 10. Distance by speed. See ST will be equal to D. ST will be equal to D. Speed by time is distance. So when I want to find out time taken, distance by speed will give me the time taken. So D by 10. First lap distance is D. Time taken is D by 10 for the first lap. Next lap distance is D. Time taken is D by 20. Third lap is D. Time taken is D by 30. Fourth lap is D. Time taken is D by 60. Now I have to find out the total distance travelled. The total distance travelled will be D plus D plus D will be equal to 4D is the total distance. This is the total distance. Total distance. Similarly, total time taken. This plus this plus this d by 10 plus d by 20 plus d by 30 plus d by 60 60 will be the lcm 60 will be the lcm so it will be 6d plus 3d plus 2d plus d will be equal to 12d by 60 or d by 5 so total time taken is d by 5 total time taken is d by 5 total distance traveled is 4d total distance by time taken will be the average speed so Total distance, total distance divided by total time taken, total time taken is the average speed, time taken will be the average speed, average speed is always like this, average speed. So this will be equal to total distance by total time taken which is 4D divided by D by 5. So this DD will cancel, so this will be equal to 4 into 5 the average speed is 20 kilometers per hour the average speed is 20 kilometers per hour so this is the answer you can also follow the harmonic mean for it harmonic mean follow for four different velocity or four distance speeds so you can use the harmonic mean but it's a complicated way like remember all these formulas but if you remember the concepts you can do like this and there's also a formula for two speeds which is 2xy by x plus y there's also a formula for two different speeds, distance travel is constant, it is 2 x y by x plus y. But don't make the mistake of doing this two and then I have done two to this and then like this. First is this two you can do, then this two you can do and then combine it like this. First this two, this two, then you can combine it, you can get an answer. But this is the fastest way of doing it, this is the fastest way of doing it, don't have to complicate things. Subscribe to my channel, I will be adding questions every now and then, wish you all the best.